Let me show you something. Everybody. Today we are at Okonomiyaki Kiji. Um, this Okonomiyaki restaurant is inside the Umeda Sky building. It's actually on the bottom yeah. floor, so you have to go down to get to here. So Okonomiyaki is kind of like a kind of like a Japanese pancake. Um, basically, it consists of like different kinds of meats and batter and a lot of cabbage. I've eaten here once before. Of course, I didn't make a you know, a Bobby Eats video about it. When I came back to Japan, I just knew I had to come back here. So I'm kind of trying to talk quietly. Um, I don't know if this is kind of too quiet, but there's a lot of people here and I don't want to disturb them. So we've ordered one pork and one beef Hokonomiyaki. Um, so one for each of us, me and Taylor. And you know, we're just gonna eat, we're gonna have a good time. And I'm gonna hopefully have Taylor kind of have a life-changing experience here today. All right, so our food has just arrived. This is the pork on okonomiyaki, and this is the beef okonomiyaki. My God, it looks so majestic, doesn't it? Itadakimasu. And we're gonna cut this bad boy. Oh, it cuts so easily. And then we're gonna cut this. Try to cut like one, one quarter piece out of there. Just look at that. So much goodness right there, man. And on the table, they got some peppers for you. So if you want to kind of spice it up a little bit, you can. I'm definitely going to go ahead and do that. Copious amounts of hot peppers on there. You can have that if you want, sir. All right, here we go. Here's the pork okonomiyaki. Huge pieces of pork, lots of cabbage, lots of vegetables. I see a lot of carrots in here, some onions, some scallion. It's very hot though. Here we go. Mm, that is magical. Oh, that is just so good. Like everything just blends so incredibly well together. Every single piece of this beautiful pancake is there for a reason. Mm. The sauce is just divine. And the cabbage, nice and crunchy. Putting the, the peppers on it really makes a world difference too. But even without the peppers, this is still fantastic. I'm not normally the biggest fan of okonomiyaki, but honestly, at this place, I could probably eat like four whole pancakes. Here's a slice of the beef. I love how well this holds together. There's been a lot of different open on that case I've eaten, and they all just really crumble apart when you try to, you know, cut it apart to make little pieces, little bite-sized pieces. But this really holds its form. And I think that's that's something that, if you're a pro, you know how to do. Really, whether you're eating the beef, the pork, you know, the seafood, or just plain veggie, you're getting the same experience. Only difference here is the meat. And I think, to be quite honest, the beef one might be the way to go. The last time I was here, I had the seafood one. And that was really good too. But man, this beef one, I think this is the clear winner. Honestly, it's just phenomenal, guys. Look at that masterpiece. All right, let's try it out with this. That just made this like 10 times better. Wow. Well, really, what else can I say? The food quality, 10 out of 10. The quantity, 10 out of 10. You could really get full off with just one of these. I'm not sure me. All right, I'm gonna wrap this up. I'm gonna crush the rest of the okonomiyaki we have left, and I'll meet you guys outside. All right, guys, we made it outside. Whew. I'm pretending like I'm full, but I'm actually not full. I'm actually really hungry still. I really want to get another one. 
and you honestly could like these things don't break the bank they're only about eight dollars each or about 800 yen each uh, our total came out to like 1684 yes 1684 for a two okonomiyaki honestly I think that's a pretty damn good deal and you know for the price for the experience for the quality of the food it's a definite must do if you come to Osaka well thank you all so much for joining me on this food adventure today make sure to subscribe so you don't miss any future content and until next time stay hungry let me show you something